Some people think the cloud is actually a cloud. For others, it's an ethereal mystery. The place where your photos and documents get sucked to and hang out. This, though, is the cloud. At least, the physical manifestation of it. It's thousands of servers and storage systems working together to hold our information. This is where all the action happens. This is where all our photos, our likes, exactly. our This is really sort of where Facebook is actually running. Look around. See over there? It's a picture of a young Ashley Vance who thought that going blonde would be a good idea. And that one? It's a lingering poke from your creepy ex. And right there is an inspirational meme helping lift people's spirits. Where does my mom find all these amazing quotes? And because we've built the infrastructure to be so redundant, we can basically pull any server and it's not going to affect any end user in, in any negative way. So we pull one out here. Um, okay, so we're going to take down Facebook. <laughs> 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 Typical Monday morning. <laughs> but it's all built to be as energy and cooling efficient as possible. So there are no fans at all on this one, as you can see. They're sort of, it's just working on yeah. the pressure difference that forces the air through. I think for most people who've never been to a data center, they're usually like these big sort of pizza box shaped yeah. things with tons of fans and moving parts going on them and you guys compacted everything down. If the industry in general started adopting a lot more of this thinking, it could really change the whole industry and not just Facebook. A Couple of corridors will go through. A typical data center relies on massive air conditioning units to pump cool air onto tens of thousands of computers. You can't pay for this kind of windblown look. Facebook is too hip for that <laughs> I'm gonna catch up. It uses cool Arctic air to keep its photo, friend, and like machines from melting down. This whole place lends itself to Sweden's meticulous attention to detail and design. The building is an engineering marvel that treats air like a pampered corgi poo. The air gets sucked in, cleaned, watered, and then sent on its way via physics with the building pressure pushing the air down onto the computers. Since Facebook gives away its service for free, this place needs to operate as smoothly and cheaply as possible to minimize the cost of each click. 